take down the one one, take down the Hilda. Double kill going over the lemon. Triple kill. Big crossbow of tank. Oh, Keyboy oh. finds a money on oh. the three man fatal link. Yes, oh, that's in the back line. Shut down, double kill, triple kill going over the sun. Wow. Want to end up being stuck in their base. Just a little bit though, because you can see that once Boxy pops a hot guard, he can be anywhere. And now combined with the Tempest of Blaze, the 505 is in some trouble. One more hit will do the trick. Boxy secures the kill. And now next is Diablo, also put in a body bag. See you soon. This is the opening that they need, and they get this Lord completely for free. I think see you soon. We're already in a pretty comfortable position to take the Lord, but taking out two members of RSG is always going to be good. This is completely going for the one shot. Ryzen getting scared off a little bit more as well. And they're still deciding whether or not should they force the issue. The turtle being pulled back as of yet. But from the sides, R7 going for the catch. Kira a little bit in the trouble as well. Real Manisha comes in, but they're taking a little bit too much damage. Albert re engaging, cleaning them all out. Double kill for Airbird. And that is going to be R here from the sides. But Ryzen waiting for the right moment from the side. He almost got it, but Vin, he held on his ultimate. Caught him by surprise. And Omega, they get completely shut down. And the snipes from Skyler to clean it out and Omega they lose them all and just like that RQ will come up on top. Once again, who's gonna commit to this one? Falcon Esports is down one member. They have a numbers disadvantage. Silent pumping out the damage on Boots. They're gonna look to commit here. CW working on the Lord. Meanwhile, they get Boots down. They're trying to distract them here. Lord still gonna be for the taking. A Newman Blast comes out, finds three, a stun, plus the Yin Yang overturn. That's gonna be a double kill for Justin. Pandemonium here in the mid lane. Silence still alive, quite low, but wow, what a play. I can't even begin to describe how well Falcon played that. It's not the right time, but from the sides as well, Adamir is going to give a big slap onto his mana as he tries to escape, and uh, he doesn't have the black shoe. Can he stall for a time? But Adamir flickering into his base, and he's going to get heavily punished for the backlight zoning. But was it absolutely worthy? Yes, it is, because Evil's SG is somehow coming up on top. But if they get the kill on Gary, and yes, they do, despite the triple kill, Evil's SG getting half for half, 50 50 trades across the board, and somehow. Because of Diamond Hook, and they've lost so many fights because of this setup, and they cannot afford to lose as of yet. Because slowly but surely, the timers are gonna kick in, but it seems like they are gonna force the issue. And this is the big hook coming in. Renzio popping the ventures, and they're forced to fight the fight as well. R7 gonna be re engaging from the sides, as you can see. They're all chunked up, and Omega, they don't really wanna fight in this home spot, but no, the snipe from afar from Skylar is gonna beam him out, and that's gonna be Chunglu and Renzio taken out of the equation. And this is exactly why Omega didn't want to force the fight, and that's the path beauty of what the prank For Evo's SG, they are in prime position. They understand that they are in the lead, but the only reason why they're losing out is because Born is non contested and now they are going to try and force the issue. They're trying their best to kill him off, but Born is going to be in a very difficult spot as Gear takes him out. However, Gear, he's expended all his spells, but he's just got a huge Ooh. level gap and he is going to completely shut down Gary as Orange Esports tried to force the fight and lost the trade-off. I mean, at this point, once again, Boxy trying to find a moment here for the team, but actually going to take some damage, should be fine. And like you mentioned, you know, I feel like those items are really going to... Oh, Iman might be in trouble. They're not going to commit this yet. They know they have to worry about the heart guard too. Sensei could be looking to go in on this one. Pops the Tempest Blades. There's the heart guard, though, that we were looking for. And now Nas going to be focused on two. Black Dragon Form comes out. The setups are here. There's the Blazing Duet, but was it enough? No one falls for RG Philippines just yet, as Sensei is taken out. And now a Boxy. This is bad news for see you soon. And they're following up on Felix. Can't escape this one as three fall for see you soon. That was so difficult to see because you could see that they were waiting for that real world manipulation to get popped off as well. And you can see that the black dragon form instantly rotated towards that area. But the problem is the conditions have to be clear. Oh, oh, oh my god, it gets wow. actually baited out once again. Who is now coming in, but here comes OP. Tempest the plays already dropped down, but Balance secures the turtle. Crossbow of Dying finds the shutdown on the Ling as Min jumps into the back line, finds the Sicilian as well. Senpai did not know what hit him. Oh, oh no! Forward, but misses the I'm offended right into the two man Numenon blast, catching out Gary as well. The Baxia goes as a killing spree to Deja, but they find the one more. That's going to be the Lanita dropping down. Boom! Just Surviving with the tiniest sliver of HP. 
missed completely, even with oh, the flicker. No. Boom, now in the back line, the knockout from the Lord. Oh, oh. Gary secures it, and now the Blazing Duet comes out in the back line. Link picks off Gary, but Deja gonna be taken out, but crossbow of Tang. OP finds Mon as well, but here comes Valance once again. OP, not enough energy, but Valance is 1v3. He has to get oh. out of this min in the back line. Still has to execute. He goes oh, on team. He no. does not. Oh, he does what? get OP. How does you that happen? Min, he what? Please shoot. Oh, He's what? alive! What? <laughs> <laughs> the finesse! This time he heard us and now he did it! What a move! Gosh. Playing textbook is real boring here. I mean, <laughs> uh, after watching what happened in Group D, wait, speaking of boring, Eloy's already found his pick. <laughs> yeah, he's R7, he's gonna get the 1v5 hey, I mentioned earlier, but they're running away from him because the rest of RQ is coming in. Ramella Izzy has to run away. Lois and Sun are separated from the rest of their team, and now RQ are just chasing them down. This is like a cat and mouse situation. Lois gonna be the first to fall. Double kill going over to Lem and massive damage. Izzy forced to run through the tower as Ramella is picked off as well. Don Light just to add insult to injury as R7 just going to catch him with the falling star moon. Four members down. Sun, the only one surviving. And now RQ looking to end this game with this minion wave. Numenon Blast on power to Tamas. He does manage to dodge it, but he is in a 1v5 situation. No way he's getting out of that. Killing spree going to RQ. A wipeout on IDNS Esports against the Lord, but they also have five members of RRQ to deal with as well. The choice now is going to be made. Will RRQ try to look for a fight here? Lord is already down. Here comes oh, Lemon. Man. Heavy crossbow. Two shots is all it takes to take down the one one. Take down the Hilda. Double kill going over to Lemon. Ooh, Triple what? kill no. going over to Irritant. Give it to him! He, find one more, but that goes it. over to Albert. So no wow. maniac here. But the game is basically over. RRQ Hoshi secured a 2-0 victory against IDNS Esports. Yep, and as of yet, with the Darkness Ball down, Evo's SG, they are a little bit more comfortable to force the fight. Eborn on the sides as well, trying to threaten some sort of separation. It seems like Evo's SG, they are going to be a little bit separated, but from the side, Sayla gets a big point damage onto his mod. He's going to be trapped out, but Sayla's play is going to cost him time. But a big oh fatal lane coming from Orange Esports. He's going to catch what? them all. Evo's SG, they can completely come on guard, and they're all what? dead, and it's going to be a wipeout for Orange Esports. Wombo Combo! One play with that Fatal Links costed EVO Singapore the game. Is it going to be an Atlas Supremacy MSC? With that DPS, as now it seems like on eSports, they might want to go for the end game, understanding that these uh, ultimates have been baited. Oh my goodness, Justin, nice play there. The Yin Yang overturn, able to find Drian. They find the target, and the Lord is secured by Silent. And now Onig eSports is falling apart in the jungle. Double kill over to Silent. Keyboy, run, because they got you. Give him a triple. Whew. Can we please get an instant replay of that? That was too good of an engage not to get an instant replay. And they're gonna force this kill angle on to Boots. He has no choice. He's gonna throw everything oh, out, but even man. that's not enough. GG, well played, Falcon. Down to the primary cores. Chiku needs a perfect crossbow of tank. Oh, Keyboy oh, finds a money on oh. the three man fatal link! Get oh. them! And now Tonak trying to press on them. ECW goes down. Yubes trying to chase down Keyboy in the middle lane. We'll get this kill here. So that find this and turn the tables around. Crazy place there. This is what you get when you don't get the purified like Mafel said. Holy boots, the only one left will be shut down as well. It's a complete team wipe. We are witnessing an absolute 180, a team wipe on Onyx Esports in a single move. So Tonek have turned the entire game around. Going to be entering the field yet again. This is the final evolution and both these teams Gonna be looking for a very juicy objective right now. Omega, the ones on top of his Zanri oh. in the back line, he finds Kelra! Picked off! Zanri loses his life, but again, he's done his job. IZ, buying a lot of time. Heart guard on Ryzen, they wanna look for the Lord. Lord. And IZ is just buying so much time. A bit of strike going to take out E2 Max. And now Ryzen isn't on the Lord. Lloyd is the one in control. Oh. Oh, 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 oh,
down, double kill, triple kill going over the sun wow. as the unstoppable streak's gonna be shut down. Maniac going over the IDNS Esports. What a save, what a save coming in from Angelina, denying two from the Lord Pit to allow Lloyds to do God's work. Well done, IDNS.